remember how to disable the YouTube autoplay function. So let's go to uh, YouTube. So let's go to YouTube. Uh, Graham Stefan. So I'm going to use Graham Stefan as an example, of course. All right, and mute him first. And we can click on a video. All right. All right, it's going to take some time. So you can see up here that on the top right, the autoplay has been already disabled, right? And so that's really fine, right? But the thing about YouTube autoplay is that it enables itself a lot. So uh, YouTube autoplay, it turns itself on, right? I search it and it says that YouTube keeps uh, re-enabling autoplay. And the reason why YouTube would re-enable autoplay all the time is that it's in YouTube's best interest to keep you watching videos after videos, right? So if you have this autoplay that automatically turned back on, it can be really annoying to go back here and click the autoplay and turn it off every single time, right? So the way you can fix this, all right, is very simple. All you gotta do is you gotta inject a JavaScript, all right? So see this JavaScript right here? Make sure you inject this into the web page, and then you can get the YouTube to uh, turn off the autoplay, okay? So basically what this does is it turns off the video autoplay if it's on in the first three seconds. So right now we have the YouTube autoplay is on, right? So we have this script which is active and it's going to do its work. So all we got to do is uh, play this video. I'm going to reload the page, okay? And you can see that within the first three seconds, this autoplay is going to get turned off. See, it got turned off, all right? So all you got to do is to make sure that you have this script enabled and then you can just, uh, it'll toggle your autoplay off automatically. And this can be very helpful when you have something like this running. Uh, I have this extension called Focus for YouTube and it allows me to have a distraction-free YouTube experience, right? So if I reload the page um, with my Focus for YouTube extension on, right, it's gonna hide the, it's gonna hide the YouTube suggested videos on the right hand side, all right? And this is how it works on Safari, but how do you get it to work on Chrome? Well, on Chrome, uh, you want to use this extension called the User JavaScript and CSS extension. And all you have to do is to simply use that same script that I have right over here and just put it in the um, User JavaScript and CSS, all right? So if you wanna see how that works, uh, it's very simple, I can just show you. Um, so let's go to YouTube. All right, um, youtube.com Graham Stefan. All right. Uh, all right. So here we have watching Graham Stefan. So I'm just going to click on a video. And um, you can see that right now, all I got to do is to right here, I have this uh, distraction for YouTube. Uh, this black button here, DF tube, is the same thing as focus for YouTube on Safari browser. But anyway, Let's say we have this autoplay on, right? If you want this thing to automatically toggle on, all you gotta do is to open up the user JavaScript and CSS extension, click add new, and then all you gotta do is go over to Safari or just copy this bit of code right here, which injects the code we want. So go to CSS and paste that, click save, all right? It'll work for all YouTube pages. And then now you can reload the browser, uh, reload the page, and then all you have to do is to make sure that um, you wait the first few three seconds and the autoplay will turn itself off. And now that you know that the autoplay will automatically turn itself off, you can go along watching videos and not worry about the autoplay turning itself back off. And the good part about having autoplay turned off is that at the end of the video, you won't be prompted to continue watching more and more YouTube videos until the end of time. And then you'll be like, wait, wh what happened to my time after three hours? All right, so this is how you uh, disable YouTube autoplay by injecting a JavaScript into the web page. Hope you enjoyed the video. This is a quick video. I'm speaking really quick because I'm short on time, but I hope you're having a, uh, I hope this helped and that's it for this video.